And that's my Even though boy, Chuck Milner's singing and songwriting career has taken him to venues inside the Kennedy boy, Center in Washington, D.C., and even the Smithsonian, most days you'll find him here, on his ranch near Raiden, Oklahoma. I'm happiest when I'm horseback, which doesn't happen near enough anymore. The directions to get here are pretty simple. Drive west until you can just see Texas, and then turn left. Through the misty veil of an early autumn rain, Chuck showed me around the place, a rugged stretch of hill country running alongside Rush Creek and carpeted in wildflowers. Even though I wasn't born here, I'm, I'm pretty much uh, in love with Oklahoma. He's the real deal, an authentic cowboy whose songs are seated in personal experience. The cowboy lives in a certain, to me, in a certain rhythm, and a lot of that rhythm has to do with the beat of a horse. When I was working on some ranches and, and uh, we didn't get any TV reception, so I would write poems and music uh, as, as a way to entertain myself. I was the only one on the ranch most of the time, so that's how it started. And Even if you think you know cowboy music, Chuck pain. Milner's songs may surprise you. There's lots to do and we never get through with our cowboy days. They're probably not typically what most people want to hear about. I don't write very much about, you know, roping wild cows or, or wrecks or things, but I write a lot about interpersonal relationships among ranch families and I'm hope, hoping I write songs that people can relate to even if they're not ranchers. A thick scrapbook chronicles the last several years of Chuck Milner's musical journey, one that now includes his kids. It all took on new meaning to have my daughter playing fiddle and my son playing mandolin. It's a, it's a lot of fun. It's funny to look back after 20 years because I always wondered you know, where, where's my career going to take me? But a, a person has to be careful that they don't miss their career while they're wondering what it's going to be like. If you've never been witness to a Chuck Milner concert, you are in luck. The musical trail takes him next to Duncan, where his talents are included in an impressive roster of entertainment slated to perform at this year's Western Spirit Celebration. You got Chuck Wagon food, which is great, and, and, and and great entertainment and you've got the museum and you got the horse thing and we're going to have a cattle drive with some longhorns. I just don't know how to get any better. You know, there's a few truly American things, um, but the cowboy is one of them. And, and I want to be able to tell at least a little bit of the story. I don't know it all, but my side of where I've been and, and, and the journeys that, that I've had. At the Western Spirit Celebration in Duncan, hidden among the campfires and cattle, you may just find a piece of yourself, just as I did during that rainy day in Raiden, when I realized that no matter where life's path has taken you, city slicker or not, there's something that will always ring true about cowboy words and cowboy ways. To finish up our cowboy in Raiden, I'm Shell Wagner.